Hey guys, um, I just received this um, guitar from VGS. Uh, it's a Tommy Denander signature guitar. And uh, other than being an awesome guitar, uh, it has two really cool features. Uh, one is the Evertune bridge, and the other is uh, the True Temperament fretboard. And uh, I'm gonna just show you a little bit out about the fretboard and the bridge. Uh, the True Temperament fretboard, is, you, as you can see, has kind of crooked frets going on here. Uh, and that's to give the guitar a uh, perfect intonation all over the neck. So what that means is that... I'm going to show you. Uh, when you're playing a chord, it's perfectly intonated on the whole fretboard. So you can, if you're playing a C chord, you can play it up here without having to tune the guitar to the chord up here. So that's really cool. And um, many people ask if it's actually hard to bend uh, with these frets because they're so crooked, but I don't really feel any difference at all. So that's the true temperament fretboard. Uh, and uh, also I'm uh, gonna show you a bit about the Evertune bridge. Uh, there is an awesome video on the Evertune uh, webpage uh, in detail on how it works. But I'm just gonna show you uh, some short bits of it. It has uh, uh, floating saddles. So there's a system at the back with uh, springs holding a spring for every saddle and module. So what that means is that the, the actual saddle is floating. So you can see as I'm bending, the saddles are moving with the bending. And, uh, and that helps the guitar to, to stay in tune. And you don't use the tuners um, at all to, to actually tune the guitar. You use the bridge to tune the guitar. So what you do is that you... Where is that thing? I have a... Small... looks like this um, they use to tune the guitar but when it's in tune it will stay in tune <laughs> it's like a normal guitar but another feature that's pretty cool that I'm interested in because I'm a pretty I'm a pretty hard picker uh, when it uh, when I'm picking the strings, and that's why I use long scale or extended scale guitars. Because when I um, yeah, play in lower tunings and on thicker strings, uh, on the shorter scale guitars, the when I pick the, the note, it goes out of tune, like it goes sharp at the point of impact. And that sucks when you're recording, and you're definitely going to have problems with um, low tune guitar with fixed strings and short scaled. So that's why I use longer scale guitar because that helps the lower tunings and the notes to stay in tune and it sounds a lot better. But with this bridge, it actually helps you if you're like a metal player, metal rhythm player like me. You're hitting the strings hard. You can ease up on the tension of the saddle. And the string won't detune uh, whatever you do to it. You can actually watch me bend a note here and and the string won't go out of tune. Listen and watch. Pretty cool, right? At some point, the saddle will go to its limit point and it will bend. 
and I'm up there, but there we go. So if you're a hard rhythm player, you can dial down the tension of the cell, and it, you're you're uh, always going to be in tune. So together, these two systems, the True Temperament and the Evertune Bridge, really makes for a cool, very innovating kind of playing way of playing guitar. 